Perspectives Unbound. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we delve into the most pressing issues of our time. Today we have a fascinating topic to discuss, the collapse of major state enterprises in South Africa. Over the past few years, these entities have faced numerous challenges and ultimately crumbled. Join us as we explore the factors behind their downfall and their impact on the nation's economy. Before we dive into the collapse, let's provide some context. South Africa has a history of state-owned enterprises, SOEs, that were once seen as the backbone of the nation's economy. They operated in sectors such as energy, transportation, and telecommunications. These enterprises were intended to promote economic growth, create jobs, and provide essential services to citizens. However, over the years, these once thriving entities encountered numerous challenges that led to their collapse. Let's discuss some of the key factors behind their downfall. Many state enterprises suffered from mismanagement and rampant corruption, which eroded their financial stability. Questionable procurement practices, inflated contracts, and embezzlement of funds plagued these organizations, diverting resources away from their core functions. Political interference in the operations of state enterprises often led to poor decision-making. Appointments based on political connections rather than merit, coupled with frequent leadership changes, disrupted continuity and hindered long-term planning. Accountability was a significant issue. Weak oversight mechanisms allowed misconduct to go unchecked, and those responsible for mismanagement were rarely held accountable, fostering a culture of impunity. To illustrate the collapse of major state enterprises, let's examine two notable examples, ESCOM and South African Airways. ESCOM, the state-owned power utility, faced severe financial distress due to mismanagement, corruption, and insufficient maintenance of power plants. This led to frequent blackouts and a reliance on expensive emergency measures, putting strain on the economy and hindering business operations. SAA, once a renowned airline, faced a similar fate. Mismanagement, corruption, and an unsustainable business model pushed the airline into bankruptcy. Constant bailouts drained public funds, and operational inefficiencies made it impossible to compete with other airlines. The collapse of these state enterprises had far-reaching consequences for South Africa. Here are some key impacts. The mismanagement and collapse of state enterprises contributed to a decline in investor confidence, negatively affecting the economy. It led to credit downgrades, reduced access to capital, and hindered economic growth, exacerbating unemployment and inequality. The collapse of state enterprises disrupted essential services, such as power supply, transportation, and telecommunications, affecting businesses and citizens. This further eroded public trust and hindered the country's development. To move forward, South Africa needs a comprehensive strategy to address the issues that led to the collapse of these enterprises. Key steps include Establishing robust governance structures and independent oversight bodies can ensure transparency, accountability, and merit-based appointments. Strengthening legal frameworks and prosecuting corruption cases is vital to rebuilding public trust. Structural reforms should focus on improving operational efficiency, introducing competition where possible, and reducing political interference. This may involve restructuring, privatization, or partnerships with private sector entities. The collapse of major state enterprises in South Africa highlights the urgent need for reform and rebuilding. By addressing issues of mismanagement, corruption, and lack of accountability, South Africa can restore investor confidence, provide essential services, and pave the way for a stronger and more prosperous future. Hit the like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel. Thank you for joining us, and remember to stay informed and engaged. Until next time, take care.